In the town of Reykjavik, Sigi, a traditional Icelandic cook, is preparing one of the signature meals of the Thoroblat festival, as the Vikings once did. You feel the punzen aroma of the shark. This freshly caught 1,700 pound Greenland shark is naturally full of urea and other toxins. These chemicals act as antifreeze, allowing the shark to live in waters as cold as minus two degrees Celsius. The toxins are so concentrated that to eat this meat could make you seriously ill or possibly even kill you. But Hildebrander Biamis' family has a secret shark recipe that goes back generations. And he knows that the only way to prepare it is to let it rot. As the meat decomposes, it oozes toxic ammonia, the chemical found in most household cleaning products, and human waste. Uh, I don't want to say the word. This will probably describe it best. P. <laughs> In Viking times, shark meat was buried out of sight. But Hildebrander prefers to see his delicacy. That way, he can keep track of the decaying process. His nose decides when it is ready to try. It's like winemaking, you know? When the meat is at a perfect, rotten state, it's hung to complete the breakdown process. After six months, it's ready to be served. Yeah, huh? This is going to be very good. It has two more months. It's going to be a great, great shark, this one. It's a social thing for us to come together and eat this. I don't like the shark. It's like ammonia. It tastes the smell like fish. It does. Despite this feast of oddities, these Icelandic partygoers see nothing bizarre about tonight's main courses. No matter what dish is served, Siggy and the Icelanders agree there is more to this tradition than just taste. The point is taking care of this tradition, having fun with it, know what it is, don't forget it, don't forget where we come from.